Hello everyone, my name is Hockular, and today I'm going to be showing you a redstone thing that I built. Uh, what I'm showing you is a redstone combination lock. It is a 20 digit combination lock. Uh, if you want, you can just look at the screen right here and count all the numbers. But this combination lock requires four levers to be pulled. And since this is for demo and this doesn't open anything, uh, I'm just going to demo them for you. So the combination is two, four, oh hold up, I better show you what it looks like before all the levers are pulled. So the door is closed, as you can see, before all the levers are pulled. And if I go over here, I pull two, and I pull four, and I pull nine, and fifteen, which is the combination the door will be opened. Now, yeah, see, look, the door is opened. Now, if I were to be, I don't know, um, if I were to be smart about it, I might want to pull all the levers. Well, see, the trick is, if you pull any lever that isn't part of the combination, it will trip it, and it will close the door, no matter which lever you pull at all. So, and also, if you... Uh, if you pull one that's not part of the lever, for example, four, it'll close the door as well. So you have to have the four uh, levers pulled, and you can't have any of the other ones pulled. Now, I'm going to show you some of the redstone behind this. Basically, back here, uh, the whole idea of it is that this is lever 15 right over here. It goes underground just for space consuming. Uh, it hook up, hooks up to an AND gate, which goes to another AND gate. Levers 2 and 4 are right there, which uh, hooks up to an AND gate, goes through this AND gate. They both go through an inverter, so that way they can hook up to an AND gate, because you have to have a positive single, and, or a positive signal, in order to hook up to an AND gate. And then they hook up to another AND gate, which goes through an inverter to open the door. So, this is what it all looks like when the combination is flipped, and everything is on and working. So let's say that I didn't flip number four. This one, or this signal right over here, will not turn on, which will not invert that torch, which will not open this AND gate. So therefore, that torch will be off, and the door will be therefore closed. Alright, and... Uh, oh, let's, let's say I wanted to be smart about it again and then choose number 8, which is not part of the combination either. I can go over here and this wire is now tripped and it does not it does not invert anymore because it's it's tripped now. It's uh, hooked up to over here and it's it's just all tripped. So, it's not invert the redstone torch is off. Shout out to DHD DibK right there. <laughs> but um yeah, that's basically how it works. Uh, which lever did I pull? I pulled eight. Alright. Um, I might do redstone tutorials like this in the future, but I'm not too sure if I will or not. Uh, please like the video. It it took a while to kind of build something like this for a YouTube video, and it's it's really cool. And I tried hard to make this video, and yeah. And, you know, subscribe to me if you want to see more things like this in the future. I'm going to be doing redstone tutorials, possibly Minecraft on the Xbox Let's Plays, possibly, I don't know, more more world showcases or showcases of redstone things. So, please subscribe to me. I need a lot of the subscriptions. This should be my first video. And I hope to see you all again. Peace.